Beast and crew, YouTube, what's up? What's good? It's your girl Jasmine back with another bay on the channel. Yes, ma'am, yes, sir. We got cricket. <laughs> we got cricket in the building. Um, I don't know what to say, just because I don't know what cricket is. Never heard of cricket. Um, but y'all know I'm into sports and a sports person told me to like look at some cricket highlights. But I'm like, bro, how can I look at cricket highlights and I don't know what cricket is? Like, I, I think I've heard of it. I know I've heard of it, but I'm just going to splat out tell you right now. I don't know what it is. So, I got told to watch this video. Just like y'all introduced um, AFL to me. Had no idea what AFL was. Never heard of it. Never seen it a day in my life until y'all introduced it to me. And then they told me to watch the rules of AFL. And I was like, wow. So, y'all told me to watch the rules of cricket. And this is what we're going to do. So let's go ahead and get into it. Like, comment, subscribe if you're new to the channel. Welcome. Welcome to Beaster Crew. Yes, ma'am. Yes, sir. And if you've been here and you support me, I appreciate you. You a real one. So let's get it, man. Let's see what cricket is. The object of the game is for your team to score more runs than the opposing team. Teams are made up of 11 players with one substitute in case of injury. At the Only beginning one? of the game, a coin toss is used to determine who bats first. The fielding team will put all 11 players on the field whilst the batting team will send out two batsmen. Batsmen always work in pairs, and a batsman cannot bat alone. The batsman's uh, job is to score runs and defend their wickets. These wickets are three wooden stumps with two wooden bales resting on top of them. They try and hit the ball away from the wickets and run to their partner's crease. If a batsman hits the ball and both men safely run to the opposite crease, this scores one run. If the ball balls- Bruh, so is this baseball? Just baseball with a little twist, you know? This little, uh, little twist. Is that what this is? Why do you only got one slug, though? Like, what if somebody else get hurt? You need more than one, you know? This ball high, wide, or throws a no ball, which is an illegal ball. This Ooh, goes my scores soda. They run. gonna throw the soda out. If the batsman hits the ball along the floor and it reaches the boundary, this scores four runs automatically without the batsman having to run. And if the batsman hits the ball in the air and it goes over the boundary, this scores six automatic runs. This is Dang, the highest scoring play that's in a cricket. Lot. It's the job of the fielding team to get the batsman out of the game. The fielding team can designate specific players to bowl the ball towards the batsman. To bowl the ball, a ball must be bowled over on and be with. Hold on, cuz. Why they all throwing that ball so hard? Why can't they just do a regular throw? They gotta like that, yeah, like they doing a. Uh... Like a run and throw. So if, if they technically if they hit like a home run, that's six automatic points. That's crazy. I know they games be high scoring. Then the channel of play. In cricket, there are ten ways for a fielding team to get you out. Number one, bowled out. If the bowler bowls the ball and it hits the batsman's wickets and knocks over the bales, he's been bowled out. Number two, caught out. If the batsman hits the ball in the air and is caught by a fielder, he's been caught out. Okay, that's common Number three, sense. run out. If the batsman runs for his partner's crease and the ball is thrown into the wickets before the batsman gets there, he's been Oh, he ain't got no out. gloves on. He's Number tripping. four, LBW. If the ball hits the batsman's leg and the umpire thinks that the ball would have hit the wickets if his leg wasn't in the way, he is ruled out by LBW leg oh, before dang, wicket. Number five, stumped out. If the batsman swings and misses the ball, the wicketkeeper can catch the ball and push the ball into the wickets. If this happens before the batsman can return to the crease, he's been stumped out. Number six, hit wickets or accidental outs. On the rarest of occasions, a batsman can get himself out Ooh, or his own partner see, out by accident. Yo, what's impressive, what's shocking me the most is them running from like the other end to that part just to throw the ball. Like I've never seen this before. Call me crazy. Call me a shell. Call me up on a rock. But like I tell you, if you if you've been on this channel, you know I be up on a rock, boy. I don't be doing nothing. Cricket. When did cricket come out? Y'all play cricket? If y'all play cricket, let me know. Is it really fun? Is it, it? Am I right? Is it on kind of the same track as baseball? Just a little different. Just a little twist. If you play cricket, let me know, cause I really would like to know. If so, what's your position? Deadly hitting the wickets themselves. The other four ways to get out in cricket almost never happen oh, okay. in today's game. These include hitting the ball twice in one stroke, handling the ball, obstructing a fielding player, or taking too long to take to the field. 
Once a batsman is out, he's replaced by the next batsman in the batting team's lineup. Once 10 players are out, the players switch sides so that the batsmen are now the fielders and vice versa. The highest run total after both sides have had Dang, their turn to bat out. wins. That's basically the game in a nutshell, but there are a few other things you'll need to understand. A bowler must deliver six legal bowls to a batsman. Once six legal bowls have been played, this is known as an over. Once an over is complete, a new bowler will then try and get the other batsman out by Child. pulling the ball from the other side. Uh, Once both teams have finished, I'm really like y'all. I'm really, really trying to understand this. It's like I understand, but I think I'm more just shocked that I never heard of this. Like I thought cricket was like, I don't know what I thought it was. I don't. But I bet they probably got tournaments and everything, just like AFL. I'm telling you, cause when I looked up into when I looked into AFL, I said, "Oh, this been going on for a minute. They got tournaments. They got, they got six foot six players, two fifty, three fifty. Like what? And I just heard of rugby like two years ago. So just think, y'all throwing all this my way. Thank you, I appreciate it. But I still got, I gotta take all this in, cause what? Finish batting, this is known as an innings. The amount of overs and innings vary depending on the format of cricket. In 2020 cricket, each team is given 20 overs for one innings. This game generally lasts about three hours. Three in one day cricket, each team is given 40 or 50 overs for one innings. As the name implies, the game generally lasts about a day. In test cricket, there are no limits for overs and the game theoretically ends when all batsmen are out and is usually played for two innings. This game can last anywhere mm -hmm. up to five days they lost and is the oldest they lost and longest form of cricket. If you're new to cricket, I highly recommend watching the highlights of any Indian Premier League game to start out with. If you're watching cricket on TV, they'll conveniently tell you how many runs have been scored, TV? how many batsmen are out, and they'll even Cricket's tell you what the other teams score and how many runs are required. What channel cricket be on? Because I need to watch it. What channel it be on? Is cricket a, uh, uh, a USA? Is it in the States? Or is this out of the country? That's my next question. I got so many questions for y'all, so I really, really hope y'all know cricket because if y'all don't know cricket, I don't know who I'm going to get my answers from. ...to win the game. Cricket may seem like a slow game, but as you watch or play it, the rules will become clear. If you have found this video at all helpful, please comment, mm -mm. like, share, and subscribe. It takes me ages to make one of these things, and good karma is always appreciated. If you're also on Reddit, feel free to discuss the video over there. Well, well, well. Learn something new every day. So if y'all play cricket, comment down below. Tell me a little bit more. Explain me a little bit more about it. If you like cricket, um, let me know why you like it. Um, <laughs> if you're somebody that's like, y'all probably looking at me like, what is wrong with her? Like, why don't she know cricket? Like, why is she so confused? Blah, blah, blah. How she never... Yeah, I'm sure y'all probably acting like there's me right now. And that's perfectly fine. It is what it is. But, you know, somebody's going to be nice enough to tell me what it is and explain it. Because I ain't never heard of this. But, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Can't wait to read y'all comments. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Notification bell, all that good stuff. With that being said, see you guys.